Welcome back to Jam League 8 Round 4. We've got Neek versus Index Zero. Yep. Um, I heard Neek is not going me, uh, what's it? He's not going Samus. So, oh, might be Bowser. toying with a bit of the secondaries. Yeah, we're going to be starting off with the Bowser. On the menu is Bowser, a Sortie, possibly Royal Crom, and I forgot what the last one is. I told him to go Lucario. Nah, Lucario is one of his actual characters, he wouldn't. <laughs> and so Bowser, not the greatest match for Mario, especially not on Battlefield, but Wait, a few what? hits have gotten him 77%. Did you say this is a bad matchup for Mario? No, it's a bad matchup for Bowser. Oh yeah, I was gonna say. Um, but Nick, oh, I, meant, I, I did right now. say it was a bad matchup for Mario, but I meant that it was a bad one for Bowser. Yeah, I mean, Nick. Great start right now, 90% onto Index Zero. He's probably at death percent to most of Bowser's moves. Up smash, ooh. That's a punish. Yeah. The thing is, Bowser has kill power. I was just about to say Kieran tends to sometimes struggle to seal out the kill, but there, there was no problems at all. Yeah. Good DI as well. He knows how to DI it. Fair will be taking it though. Yeah, I think Battlefield is like, the best stage for both Bowser and Mario, so we'll see how this plays out. Um, I reckon it's definitely better for Mario. Yeah, Mario can get a lot of those ladder combos, but Bowser, the Bowser bombs will be killing really early off the top platform. Like one of the, like, Mario is one of those characters where even if Battlefield is also your character's best stage, you still ban it because you don't want Mario to have it because it's even better for him. Yeah. Another thing is, Kieran likes to use a lot of aerials, so Tough Guy is not going to come into effect as much nope. in this matchup. Right now, the up airs that we're talking about. Good Ooh. DI, not going to kill, yes. but uh, four up airs. so That's far all... some really clean combos. Like, if Kieran wants to scare a Neek off of- Oh, sheesh! Clean confirm. <laughs> like, I reckon if Kieran wants to scare Neek onto playing his actual main, or one of his mains, is that an SD? Yeah, it yeah. was. Then this is the game to do it. Zero percent, both of them. Last stock. Definitely could go either way. Yeah. Both of them being really careful right now. Dude, Are before Nick was doing the um the Bowser ledge hang, it's like such a funny animation. It is very funny. And right now, oh, if players is playing a bit of nooch. He's on the dude that being on that on the ledge there against Bowser was so scary. It's like that's big damage. Yeah. 22% and another 20% will we see an, another 18% that's not 18 that was 14 is he dead he's not dead good uh, DI yeah great DI but but one Nika's, more Nika's really taking control of this game so far Kira needs to be so careful yeah and one more Bowser bomb will do oh, it so he yeah. has to be really careful that fireball was not the play is it looking a bit scary for Kira? oh that's Off the Bowser stage. bomb that should be it yep yep he's gonna bye bye Mario it. Game one. Two Nick. Yeah, that was actually a pretty good showing from Nick's Bowser. However, that was such a clean confirm. Yeah, Nan to back air. I did not even know it. you could do that. <laughs> True combo. Um, Bowser, man. Oh, oh switching to the Pokemon. Oh, yeah, PT. That was the extra one. That was the one I forgot. PT is definitely going to be more tricky. He's still on Battlefield. Neek is really given Kieran the home stage advantage here. I mean, have you ever seen Neek's PT before? I haven't. Neither. But <laughs> it's a squirtle. Off to I a would assume start. it's like of a similar, probably maybe a worse. The best PT like that actually plays PT and is active in Chain League is probably Ice Banana at the moment. Mm, yeah, go on. Ooh, oh, the, the taunt! The mid taunt? <laughs> Replaying the favor is Nick. <laughs> yeah, but I, I have never seen this PT before, but it's looking pretty clean. I mean, he's playing Squirtle like he plays Jigglypuff. Yeah, he does play Jigglypuff, that is true. Yeah, it's getting those straight hits in and out. Index zero, finally getting an opening. Let's see what he can do with it. Oh. Keeping him near ledge, real good. Oh, great drop down up B. Gonna be just clearing all that. Uh, space for Neek. 
Nika's not switched Pokemon yet, which is interesting. Yeah, I think he's doing the um the one stock per Pokemon thing. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> Wait, oh my god, that killed. Dude, it was like the very tip of up smash connecting onto Mario. It was the tip of up smash and also a late hit of it. Yeah. I, I mean, I guess it's enough. And you really do not want to be a stock down against Squirtle because he can rack up that percent so fast. Yeah, but then again, you can kill Squirtle really quickly. It's just Kieran needs to find the right opening, the right smash attack probably yeah, to take it out. The thing is, Squirtle oh. is easy to kill, but like hard to find the opening to do that with. Yeah. Ooh, that was so scary. I don't think he had a jump. Back there throw should take it. Yep. yep. All right, one one per stock it is. Yeah, now switching to the Ivysaur. See how good his Ivysaur is. And this is really scary, because Mario is pretty much already at death percent from the Ivysaur. Just like that is true. A down for up air or down for up B probably will take it. Ooh. Definitely not bullet seed. That was such a punish. But no. Be a rest bullet seed. You'll love to see it. Oh. Oh, I like all forward throw, that's... Ooh, oh, nice! Yeah. Very clean spike. Oh my god. Nice he switched! Five. Oh, he had to switch! You coward! Neek, you coward! Oh my god, Scott got sent to the moon. Ah, uh, yeah, finally going back to the Ivysaur. I don't know, I reckon... I reckon Kieran wins this one. Yeah. That was... Not cool. Yeah, from what I can tell, he knows like the basics of the character, but he probably doesn't have enough as much, much experience with it. Yeah. I mean, down to the final stock. This is very doable, especially when Neek is on that Charizard. You know, he has a very big body. Yeah, big bodies love getting comboed by Mario. Yep. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Dude, what? The hitbox just barely ran out there! Yeah. That was so scary, Kieran nearly falling a victim to that flare blitz. Yeah, that would have been it just right there. Oh, Charles. Oh, no! Oh, there we go. <laughs> Jump scare, flare blitz. Can't Strikes avoid it again. twice. They're gonna be sealing out game two. Yeah, look at this. This absolute cross map flare blitz. It's... You just can't be ready for it. Mm. It's such a fast move because you're like, oh. Charizard, he's on the opposite side of the stage. What's he I'm gonna safe. do to me? Yeah, I am. Flare Blitz. Yeah. The, the real threat of Flare Blitz is the fact that it's it's basically your fight, flight, or freeze response to it. Yeah, I mean, you should and just parry it, Lamel. Oh, he's gone Lucario instead of a sortie, like you suggested. Yeah, now I don't have to remake the thumbnail. You don't even need to parry it. It's pretty punishable, even without True. it. Yeah, you can just shield F Smash. Yeah, literally. Now this one, sort of sealing Kieran's fate potentially because Nick is like actually experienced and like c familiar and comfortable on the Lucario. Yeah, Nick's Lucario is not a joke. It's something that we have seen before. I'm not sure in the league. It is a joke, but I mean, it's not as much of a joke. Mate, this Lucario could probably, could yeah, it would get top six. I would argue that all of his characters are a joke to some extent, but. Yeah, no, I reckon the Lucario would get top 16. Yeah. Right now, Kieran, off to a great start against the Lucario, but you need to kill him soon, or he will build up that aura. Yeah. Which is this always is definitely scary. like still in the range where Nick can take it back and like start taking it back. Oh yeah, hundred percent. Lucario is never out until you actually kill that, until you get that final hit on that stock. Because it's like, yeah, you're doing all this damage, but you're just building up his aura. So when Neek finally gets his attacks in, they'll deal an absolute, they'll pack like an absolute punch. Yeah, just like that. Orosphere alone has gone a third of the way of bringing it back. <laughs> yeah, actually, this is crazy. Ooh, he's not dead. Side B, almost Very taking it, close. and there's another third of the way of bringing it back. And back here, we'll just take it. Dude, just like that. There's like, what, four hits? Yeah. And this is the most scary bit, when Lucario... Has There's that a aura. stock up and has the Vax aura. <laughs> yeah. Up, yeah. Oh, down there, not gonna kill yet. 
Oh my god. That was an up smash. That's unfortunate. Just it's landing hard, in front of his opponent. Yeah, you definitely don't expect it. He loves to hop around and be reverse that. Yeah, it's because if um if Kieran lands into it, you can do like what, cancel into back air and it just yeah, kills. Yeah, something like that. But yeah, finally gonna be able to take up that tilt. Tora out of here. He will be not doing as much damage for a while until he gets that percentage built up. Oh my god, parrying the up smash. Yeah, Mario on 100% is a bit scary. Ooh, wait. He got caught with a tiny bit of the aura spear. At but, like, the moment, he doesn't in. have enough aura. Oh my god. Yeah, that that's dead. Where is he going? Uh, that's a neat moment. Yeah. He wants this to be a fair fight, I guess. SD for an SD. Yeah. He's gonna be sacrificing aura for that as well, though. Oh my god, he's just throwing the Mario around. Yeah, Kira needs to get like an early update oh! combo. Oh no, he's fine. Nah, he's a carrier. Yeah. Yeah, needs to get another one of those if he wants to seal out this game. And potentially make a reverse Frio comeback. There's a start up there, not quite connecting. I believe. I reckon the Mario's got this. He just needs to get a reflect on... on one of those Aura Spheres that he's good. Oh my god! <laughs> oh yeah, true. Just cape and Aura Sphere. Yeah, exactly. Cape and Aura Sphere. Wait, he's just standing there! <laughs> Menacingly! Well, he actually is teabag, he's not just standing there. Yeah. Neek going for the mental damage. Up throw? No, no going mash. for all the pummels. He's just pummeling! That's... He's clowning. He's so clowning. You can hear him, like, laugh from the he's other giggling. side of the room. He's, he has a maniacal giggle. Oh, that's disgusting! And then he just counters the Nair. Nick, gonna be taking it 3 0. Oh. What yeah. did I just witness? What is this? What What is this? What the hell did I just. Oh. Uh, it That's most a... certainly was not sanctioned bullying. That was a call to police. A call an ambulance, but not for me moment. Uh, I have no words to describe that set. Yeah, honestly, neither.